بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم اینڈ السلام علیکم ڈیئر اسٹوڈنٹس آر ٹوڈیز لیسن از ریلیٹڈ ٹو اینادر ٹائپ آف سوشل بیہیویئر وچ از کال دا ٹیریٹوریل بیہیویئر اور دا ٹیریٹوریالٹی سو اکارڈنگ ٹو دا ڈیفینیشن ٹیریٹوریل بیہیویئرس آر دا میتھڈس بائی وچ این اینیمل اور دا گروپ آف اینیملس پروٹیکٹس اٹس ٹیریٹری فرام دا انکرجنس بائی ادرس آف اٹس اسپیشیز اکارڈنگ ٹو دا برڈ territory is the protective part of the home or the area around the home site over which the animals normally travels while according to the Heidegger area animal lives in and prevents other members of his species from entering this is called its territory now what is territory we will see it in detail A territory is a delineated or the defined area which contains the resources and animals need to survive. The area occupied more or less exclusive by an animal or the group and defense by the aggressions or advertisement is a territory. In ethology, the term territory refers to any sociographical area that an animal or the particular species consistently defend against the conspecifics. Conspecifics are the members of the same species or occasionally the animals of the other species. Territories may be held by an individual, a mated pair or a group. Territories of the conspecifics con specifics do not overlap that means they have the deadlines so here first of all we will see that the territorial behavior is adoptive in many ways it may permit an animal to meet without interruption or to raise its young in an area where there will be little competition for the food so this is the first purpose of defining the territory it can also prevent the overcrowding by maintaining an optimum distance among members of the population so this was the explanation of explanation of the mated type of the territory so the mated type of the territories may be the seasonal in many songbirds the mated pair defends the nest and the feeding area until after the young are fledged in commonly nesting birds or the communally nesting birds such as the gulls the territory may simply consist of the nest itself territorial animals defend area that contain a nest den or the mating site so this is another type of the territory in which the organism wants to define in uh, the territories to save their you can say the habitats and the sufficient food resources for themselves and their young ones defense rarely takes place from the from of over fights because more usually there is a highly noticeable display which may be usual as in the red breast of the robin or the gelada baboon fins are displayed by the mud skippers so these behaviors you can watch in the figure so the first of all first figure is explaining the mud skippers which are displaying their fins to define the territory and the robin and the baboon is expressing or displaying their red chest for you can say advertising the their territories now some other kind of the advertisement for defining the territories may be the id tree or the olfactory so id tree we can watch in the bird songs or the calls of the gibbons or the olfactory through the deposits of the scent marks so many territorial mammals use scent marking to signal the boundaries of their territories the marks may be deposited by the urination by the defecation or by rubbing the parts of their bodies that bear the specialized scented scent glands against the substrates for example the dogs and other scent marks by the urination and the defecation while the cats scent marks by rubbing their faces and flanks against the objects as well as by the notoriously persistently smelling spray of the urine so these are the different types of the um, advertisement for marking their territories 
but some other type of the advertise advertisements which involves for the mar uh, marking of their territories may be in the form of the aggressions for example the wolf packs maintain territories in which they hunt and live these areas are aggressively defended from all other non pack members non pack members are those which are not including in the wolf packs so the male cougar has a large territory that may overlap the territories of the several females but it is defended against the other males responding to the scent marks the inhabitants of the overlapping ranges also avoid each other except for breeding now finally we watch the significance of the territoriality or the territorial behavior it ensures food supply and availability of a mate for the sexual reproduction secondly it provides privacy for the complex reproductive cycles and reduces the chances of the over exploitation of the natural resources thirdly it helps in population control and many individuals fail to get suitable territory so this is all for the territorial behavior thank you and allah hafiz